program. I hope all of you will enjoy the skits I have planned for this evening. My theme will be funny kangaroo videos. Wait. My theme will be clothing. <laughs> there are many types of clothing, from underwear to hats. What can anyone name the most important type of clothing? Shorts. Shorts are important. They are very nutritional. Anyone else? Yes. Jimmy. Socks, so then you don't get a uh, blister. <laughs> yes, that is important, but bl but blisters make excellent food for the fish. Anyone else? All right. Well, those are all very important kinds of clothing, but each article of clothing is so different. You can't really really judge each of them fairly. So. Clothing can do a lot of things. As you will see in this skit, clothing can help ma hide emotions or it can magnify them. But before that skit, I would like to introduce Bobo, the monkey with horrible fashion sense. <gasps> <laughs> Sorry, Bobo. Bobo's fire lighting skills are better than his fashion skills. <laughs> <laughs> Well, while Bobo keeps trying to light his fire. Ooh, I'm mine. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Please uh, brace yourself for the brown pants skit. <laughs> Ahoy, Captain. Enemy ships off the starboard bow. How many? One ship, sir. Fire the cannons! <laughs> Woohoo, we sunk it. Oh, wait. <laughs> um. <laughs> enemy. Uh, heh. <laughs> okay. Captain, enemy ships off the starboard bow. How many? Two ships, Captain. Bring me my red jacket so I won't see my blood if I'm wounded. It has red stains on it, but if you say so. Fire the cannons. Kapow! Woohoo, we sunk them both. Ahoy, Captain. Enemy ships <laughs> off the starboard bow. How many this time? Five ships, Captain. Bring me my red, my red jacket so I won't see my blood if I'm wounded. Okay. Fire the cannons. Kapow! Ooh, we sunk them all. Ahoy, Captain. Ships off the starboard bow. How many this time? Forty ships, Captain. Boy, Captain. bring me my brown pants. <laughs> I just got it. Clothes are meant to be clean. So, for some of you 
stickier ones out there. <laughs> you might want to consider taking a shower and using camper soap. Please enjoy the skit camp soap. So, I'm here today to show you the amazing camp soap. Ultra Max. Because it's cool. So, it will get all of your dirty laundry twice as clean and smell twice as good. So first, we have the shirt here. The Scoutmaster shirt, I think. I, I don't know. But, they, if you scrub it in here with that magic soap I told you about, it smells clean, looks clean, and feels clean. Now, if you take some of his pants, you can scrub them around in here, and they, they, they look great, they feel great, and they smell wonderful. And finally, we have the socks, and when we scrub these around in here, they look great, they feel great, and <laughs> How many of you have ever annoyed a store clerk at Walmart? <laughs> Yesterday, we don't sell pets. So tomorrow we will then. No, we we don't get out. How do you do? Okay, look. If you come in here one more time, I am going to hose you down. Go. That sounds fun. Get out. Did the drought affect your hose too? No. So your hose is working? Attention! Our order of clean socks has finally arrived. <laughs> if you want to line up, I'll start passing out your socks. Okay, guess you don't need any socks. Yes, sir. Can you get some socks? How many socks would you like? You don't know? How many socks would you like? Uh, two. Two pair or one for each foot? <laughs> Here, take your sock. Thanks. Go. Next. Next. Nobody needs any socks? 
Yes. Hiya. Hi, how are you? Good. Good. How many socks do you need? I want four. Ya. Four? Yes. Well, why four pair? You're such an exciting scout. Well, so I can wear them on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. That makes perfect sense. I'm so glad you're a clean scout. Thank you, sir. Good yeah. job. What? What is that? Next on my list. Oh, you made it. Let's see. Let me find your name on here. Strewing. Okay, how many socks? I need seven. Seven? You are a really good scout. You make a scout master so happy. Um, good job. What do you need them for? I need one for each day of the week. Good job. Good thinking. <laughs> and next. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> no, no, no. No. I need 12 pair. Wow. First I we got a four pair. And then a seven pair. Why do you need 12 pair? Well, I mean, there's January, February, March, <laughs> and just a month of the year. Here, there's no hope for you. <laughs> Socks are very, very important. They're good for hiking and sleeping just in your socks. So, you always want them to be clean. This is the dirty socks. Chocolate! <laughs> oh, it's poop! <laughs> I love cow. Yeah, I don't know why I wouldn't like this. I love this stuff. Never the little bit. <laughs> we all know that men really, really, really hate anything that has to do with clothes. Going shopping for clothes, watch or watching extremely boring TV commercials. So, today, we have a very exciting guest to tell you <coughs> all about the wonderful world of the new clothing. Please welcome Billy Mays with Human Clothing! Hi, Billy Mays here, and I didn't forget my lines this time. But, uh, <laughs> today, I have an amazing product from the makers of the Magic Hat and ShamWow. I'm on TV. We have. Hi, Mom. We have the amazing. Hi, Mom. We, Hi, Mom. Shut up, model. You're the model. <laughs> Stay in there. Today, we have the amazing human clothing. Oh. It, it fits all your needs. It's very, very easy to travel, as you can see. It's also light and airy. <laughs> But wait, there's more. No way. You don't only get the amazing human clothing, you also get a pair of human shoes. <laughs> they run by themselves. <laughs> They're easy to travel in. And not just that, but you also get OxyClean. Man, my suit is so dirty, all this running and dirt and fire blowing. Look at that thing. 
Oh well, and today we have a boxing lead. You know what? I do work pretty well. Yeah, that's all. And you get a ninety-nine dollar value. Here's your free sample. Five thousand dollars. Organic material. Five payments of one thousand dollars. Ninety-nine dollar value. All yours. We have all seen the J.C. Penny skit, so I thought maybe I would take it and twist it and bend it and tune it until it was made by my own creation. Please brace yourself for. The Jade, the Mason skit. <laughs> Scoutmaster Minute on clothing. So, but actually, it's probably a little easier than you think. And I want to talk to you guys about your outer garments as well as your inner garments. And so, to talk about our outer garments, I've asked Mitchell if he would come down. Mitchell, if he would come down. Mitchell! Every week at our scout meetings, we talk about the importance of your scout uniform. And I have Mitchell here because even though he's only joining us for today, how nice he looks. All right. Mitchell's in his scout uniform, um, fully in class A. So why is that important? Why do we go on that all the time about your uniform? It's because we want you to take pride in yourself. We want you to take pride in the organization. We want you to be all alike in how we set ourselves apart from other groups. And it's important that you take pride in yourself. So when you come to a meeting or you come to an event and your shirt doesn't match up with the buttons or your shirt's hanging out or you've got one scout sock on and some other sock off, <laughs> He's okay. <laughs> You're not showing pride in yourself, let alone pride in our truth. Thank you very much. 
but more importantly, there's also the garments that you wear inside. And you're thinking, how do you put clothing on the inside? We are taught to clothe ourselves with humility, with compassion, with kindness, and other virtues that sound an awful lot like the Scout Law. And we've been talking a lot the last couple nights about the Scout Law. So when you are thinking about getting dressed, whether it's for school, for church, for a Scout meeting, for wherever you're going, one of the things we learned way back in Cub Scouts is to do your best. And I want you to challenge you to continue that. Don't forget about those values and those traditions that we learned way back then. For some of you, it wasn't so way back, but to take on doing your best, looking your best, putting your best foot forward, and wearing the best clothing and the best garments you can inside. Thank you. 